In this video, we will show you how to create your first screen in Factory Talk Optics by using common graphical elements like buttons, text, and LEDs. Starting from a project which has already been created, go to the project view and expand the UI folder by clicking on the small black triangle on the left hand side of the folder. You will find three items here, the default style sheet, the presentation engine, and the main window. The default style sheet and the presentation engine will be explained in another video. Select the main window with a single click. You can change the properties of the main window to select whether your project will be shown in a full screen or in window mode. The demo will run in the window mode. Therefore, we can keep the property as false. Double click on the main window to open it. In the editor, there are two ways to add UI elements. The first method is from the context menu. Right click on the main window, select New, Base Controls, and you will see a list of all the available base elements. The second method is to use the Type View panel. Double click User Interface, then double click Base Controls. Drag and drop the selected element to place it on the main window. Let's add an LED, a label, and a button. Select all three objects and align them centrally. Note that you can change the various properties of an element. For example, the color of the LED can be modified, or the text property of the label. For this demo, Let's change the text property of the label to status. We will now configure the button to control the LED. For this demo, we will use an internal variable. This variable can be configured later to connect to an external variable from a PLC. Navigate to the Model folder. Right-click on Model, select New, and then Variable to create a new variable. Select the new variable and change the data type and the property window to Boolean. Now we can drag and drop the variable to the LED's active property. The value of the variable will now determine the state of the LED. We need to change the value of the variable so let's create a mouse click event for the button. Select the button. In the events pane, we can add a new mouse click event by clicking on the plus sign. Select commands, variable commands, and then select toggle. Drag and drop the Boolean variable we created earlier to the variable to modify argument of the mouse click event. We can run the emulator to see if clicking the button will change the status of the LED. You have now created your first screen. Thank you for watching.